Hello, and in this video, we are going to learn two different ways to transpose data from column to row or from row to column. First, by using the transpose function, and secondly, by using the paste transpose feature. Okay, so let's get to it. First, let's learn how to transpose data using the transpose function. And you can see that our original data has five columns and two rows. So in order to use the transpose function, we would first need to select an area that has five rows and two columns. All right, now let's enter the transpose function. Equal transpose open bracket. Array here means the original data. So select the original table. All right, now close bracket. Now transpose is an array function. So this means that it works with a block of data instead of a single cell. What this means for us is that instead of pressing enter, we will need to press shift control enter so that Excel knows that this is an array function and it will return the value for a block of data instead of for a single cell. Okay, so control shift enter and there you have it. All right, so the first method is done. So the transpose function works fine, but it's a bit time consuming and quite complicated as well. So let's explore another method by using the paste transpose feature. Okay, so let me delete this. All right, now to use the paste transpose feature, it's quite simple. First, we will need to select the original data. All right, control C to copy, and then control V to paste. And here you might think that it will not work, but don't worry. Just press the drop down arrow and select the last uh, option, transpose, and it's done. Now, another method is to copy the data and then go to where you want to paste the data to. Right click and then just select the transpose feature. And that's done. Happy learning and see you in the next video.